Namaste students, welcome to our EVS class. So today we are going to learn block 11 surface water and ground water. On the screen you can see a water waterfall. This is a natural water body. Right? It is so beautiful to look at. Now let's move on with our lesson. We already So we already know the different sources of water like the sea, rivers, ponds, lakes, dams, reservoirs, wells. Okay, today we will learn how to classify them, how to sort them, right? So the keywords key words we are going to learn are spring. What is a spring? Place from where water comes to the surface from underground. Source, source means place from where something begins. Step, step. Step 3. Identify the water sources in the pictures. So, if you look at this picture, try to find out what is this. This is a lake, right? What is this? This is a dam, okay? When a river is flowing, if humans build a big wall to stop the flow of water, then it is called a dam right so na next let's move on let us watch this video water that can be seen on the surface of earth water under the soil let's see if these examples are of surface or ground water examples of ground water Examples of surface water. Right? Let's move on. Okay. What are the different sources of water? Let's so rivers, springs, oceans, dams, and wells are different sources of water. Some are natural such as lakes, rivers, springs, oceans and seas. Some are human made such as dams and wells. Pot. How can we classify the sources of water? Let's summarize. We can classify sources of water as surface water and groundwater sources. Water sources such as rivers, lakes, seas, oceans and glaciers that can be seen on the surface of the earth are surface water sources. Water sources such as springs and wells found below the surface of earth are groundwater sources. Okay, look at this picture students. So, you can even draw this in your classwork book, in your notebook, sources of water. Okay, sources of water is of two types, surface water and ground water. In surface water, we have the water bodies as lakes, rivers, stream, ocean and glacier. In ground water, we have well and spring, right? Let's learn more. Pot. Why can't we use most of the water available on earth? Okay, we can't use the water from all the water bodies. Let us know what are these water bodies. Let's. Most of the water on the earth is found in oceans and seas. We cannot drink it or use it for our daily needs because it is salty. Most fresh water in nature is found in solid form as ice in cold regions or on top of mountains. This source of water is not easily available to use. Okay, it is not even e easily available for us to use. Okay. Now all of you open your workbook, Nana. Open to worksheet 10.1. Put today's date. Name the different types of water sources. Use the helping words in the box. Uh, the words here are hand pump, pond, well, glacier. Okay. So, the first picture you can see it is a well. Okay. W-E-L-L -L, well. 
second picture in the second picture you can see a huge very big mass of ice so this is a glacier g l a c i e r glacier in the third picture you can see that a small water body that is surrounded by land on the all the sides so this is a pond p o n d pond c is a pond okay d1 is a hand pump right now second question complete the table using the help box in the help box we have the words ocean well river spring you have to sort them and put them under the ground water or surface water you have to identify whether they are ground water or surface water so ocean is surface water well is ground water river is surface water spring is ground water so write the words under them question 3 why can't we use water from the oceans and seas for drinking the answer is we can't use water from the oceans and seas for drinking as the water is salty salty s a l t y salty right uh, then let's move on and open our practice book okay answer our practice questions okay. practice questions so all of you open your content book so the practice questions here question 1 write if true or false a streams and rivers provide us with salty water this is false okay streams and rivers provide us with salty water is false f a l s e false why because this uh, this provide us with fresh water b springs and tube wells get water from the ground yes that's true b1 is true t r u e true okay then second bit fill in the blanks a river is a source of dash surface water for us or ground water for us okay it is surface so write the spelling s u r f a c e okay b bit water in a tube well comes from dash water in a tube well comes from ground g r o u n d ground third question why can't water from the seas and oceans be used directly water from the seas and oceans cannot be used directly because it is salty so we have uh, discussed the answers in the worksheet as well as the practice questions in the content book also complete writing this answers do read the lesson from the content book two times and underline new words thank you that's all for now have a good day bye bye